Here's another quick lesson on Word. We're going to learn how to use headers and footers. First off, we'll copy our title line. And then we go to View, Header, and Footer. We paste it in here. And we'll paste it twice because this is too wide to fit on one line. And on the first line, we'll just delete the date. Delete my name. And this one's simple. We can just go to Home and Center Justify. For the next line, we'll delete the title. And we don't want to format using spaces. Because if I type more in, it will ruin the formatting. So we'll undo that. Proper way to do this, and we can see that spaces are there with the dots by revealing non printable characters. We want to fix this with a tab, and we're going to learn how to use tab stops. We format tabs. And we can see that the right margin is roughly 3.8. And we want to write tab stop. We'll set it and then say OK. And then that works. OK, now if I delete and put my name in there, it just formats it properly. So the advantage of using the tab stops rather than space is it will preserve the formatting for us. And we probably don't want to double space the header. So we'll do that. And before we close the header, we'll also want to insert page numbers. So you just need to click in the footer, go to insert, page numbers, and you can choose different ways to format it, left, right, center, and we'll pick right. And if we scroll down to the next page, you'll see that it automatically numbers the page. If we just try to enter a one, so if we undo, if we enter a one, and we go down to the next page, you'll see that it's just one. By using the insert, it knows how to number the pages properly. And that completes this quick lesson.